rank of the matrix using maxima find rank of the matrix of matrix A is equal to 2 minus 3 5 1 3 1 minus 1 2 1 4 <coughs> 1 4 minus 6 1 now we know that the rank of matrix is nothing but the number of non zero rows number of non zero rows in row echelon form or reduced row echelon form of matrix form of the matrix so first we want to reduce this matrix to row echelon form and then then number of non zero rows or number of leading one are called is called the rank of the matrix a now to reduce this matrix to row equal form we want this entry should be one but it is two but in this column one is present in the third row so first row operation we are going to apply is interchange the first row and third row so we get one four minus six one three one minus one two uh, 2 minus 3 5 1 next by using this one now to we want to make we want to make this one equal to leading one for this we want to make these two entries should be zero for that again we are going to apply row operation r2 we want to replace this r2 as r2 minus 3 times r1 and for r3 for this 2 we are going to use r3 is equal to r3 minus 2 times r1 so we get 1 4 minus 6 1 then 3 minus 3 is equal to 0 1 minus 12 1 minus 12 it is equal to minus 11 then minus 1 minus 1 uh, plus 18 it is equal to 17 and then uh, 2 minus 3 is equal to say here 2 minus 3 is equal to minus 1 next uh, i am going to change your color no yes. next uh, 2 minus 2 is equal to 0 then minus 3 uh, minus 8 minus 3 minus 8 is equal to again minus 11 5 my, uh, plus 12 is equal to 17 and 1 minus 2 is equal to what minus 1 now next next uh, so now this is what a leading one now next we want to make uh, this entries uh, uh, the first non zero entry in the second row should be one for that we are going to uh, use row operation as multiply minus 1 by 11 r2 so if you use this uh, row operation then we get 1 4 minus 6 1 0 1 minus 17 by 11 and 1 by 11 and third row as it is 0 minus 11 17 minus 1 now next since we want to make this entry is equal to leading 1 for that for that we want this entry should be 0 this entry should be 0 so for that we are going to use the row operation r3 is equal to r3 plus 11 times r2 so if you use this row operation then first row as it is since we change the third row only so first and second row as it is minus 6 1 then the second row is 0 1 minus 17 by 11 1 by 11 and the third row becomes 0 minus 11 plus 11 0 now 11 11 11 get cancelled here since 17 uh, you can check here 17 minus 17 into 11 multiply by 11 so 11 11 get cancelled here 17 minus 17 is equal to 0 next if you multiply it by 11 here also if you multiply by 11 11 11 get cancelled here and minus 1 plus 1 is equal to what 0 now this last matrix satisfy all the condition of a row echelon form matrix so this matrix is in a row echelon form Kilon form.
since the first non zero entry of this two row is equal to two non zero row is one this first condition is sold there exists zero row which is uh, present at the bottom of the matrix and the leading one in the second row is um, uh, is present in the right hand side of the leading one in the higher row so all the three conditions satisfy therefore this matrix is in row equal form and therefore number of non zero rows so what is the rank of this matrix how many non zero rows are there two or how many leading one two so this is the rank of uh, this matrix now we are going to use the maxima for to find the rank of this matrix so for that we want to enter the matrix so we want to pass uh, we are going to use the matrix function and for the matrix function we are going to pass the list of uh, list contain the uh, rows so the first row is what uh, 2 minus 3 5 one then next the next uh, row is 3 1 minus 1 2 okay next you can use the third uh, row is 1 4 minus 6 1 so now we get this matrix A and you can use the rank of this matrix A then it is equal to rank of this matrix is equal to 2. Also you can use the echelon if we use this command echelon of matrix A then you get the echelon form of the matrix. So 1 minus 3 by 2, 5 by 2, 1 by 2, 0, 1 minus 17, 11 uh, by 11, 1 by 11. So here they have divided instead of interchanging here we have interchanged these two row in the first uh, uh, that is first row and third row but here um, uh, they are uh, in maxima uh, they make this entry one by dividing this row by uh, two so for it uh, you can check here okay i am writing again this matrix so what is the matrix a here a is equal to a is equal to say uh, two minus three 5 1 3 1 minus 1 2 then 1 4 minus 6 1 so uh, in the first uh, method we interchange the first and third row but now in this method uh, in this step what we are going to use we are we are going to uh, make this entry 1 by dividing the first row by 2 so if we use 1 by 2 r1 then we get the matrix A is equal to 1 minus 3 by 2, 5 by 2 and 1 by 2. We get here 3, 1, minus 1, 2 and 1, 4, minus 6, 1. Now if you use the row operation as R2, since we want to make this in, this two entry should be 0. So R2 is equal to R2 minus 3 times R1 and r3 is equal to r3 minus r3 minus r1 so if you use this row operation then we get 1 minus 3 by 2 5 by 2 then 1 by 2 so here 3 minus 3 0 now here uh, we are going to multiply by minus 3 so it is 9 by 2 so this 2 uh, 9 by 2 it is what 11 by 2 next uh, 5 by 2 so if you multiply 5 by 2 say if you multiply here uh, 5 by 2 uh, by 3 then it is minus 1 minus 15 by 2 so it is minus 17 by minus 17 by 2 and next 1 by 2 so it is 2 minus 3 by 2 so it is uh, 4 it is what 1 by 2 next so 1 minus 1 0 here 1 minus 1 0 uh, 4 uh, minus um, 4 plus 3 by 2 so 4 plus 3 by 2 it is equal to 11 by 2 then minus 6 uh, minus 5 by 2 so it is minus 12 minus 12 plus 5 is what minus 17 by 2 and last 1 minus 1 by 2 it is what 1 by 2 now you can check these two rows are same or you can make uh, you can make this uh, is entry is equal to 1 by multiplying 2 by 11 r2 so if you use this row operation then we get 1 minus 3 by 2 5 by 2 1 by 2 
and here it is 0 1 uh, since we multiply it is minus 17 by 11 and it is what <coughs> 2 by 11 so it is 1 by 11 and next the third row as it is so it is 0 11 by 2 minus 17 by 2 and 1 by 2 now if you use the row operation as if you use here r3 minus 11 by 2 r2 then we get uh, we get since we want to replace r3 then we get 1 minus 3 by 2 5 by 2 1 by 2 it is 0 1 minus 17 by 11 1 by 11 and we get here 0 0 uh, 0 uh, then uh, it is what uh, it is what 0 so this is what a row column form of the matrix and now you can check here it is what 1 minus 3 by 2 5 by 2 1 by 2 okay and uh, 0 1 minus 17 by 11 and 1 by 11 so this is what a row column form of the matrix in first method we interchange the first and third row to make first entry first non-zero entry in first row is equal to 1 so but in both the methods you will get the rank of the matrix is what 2 so in this way you can use a maxima to find the rank and echelon form of the matrix A.